So in the cloud today, and unfortunately we can see that we've got the engine management light on, a little picture of the airbag, and obviously it's telling us to check airbag. So I thought we'd get the scanner plugged in and work out exactly what the fault is. So as ever, unfortunately, until I get some better editing software, what I'm gonna have to do is screen record on the phone. Okay, so it turns out that unfortunately, the VPIC scanner doesn't support the airbag module in this cloud. But you can see anyway, that I've managed to get the airbag light off, the warning light's gone off, and the error message is gone. So what did I do? So coming into the car, underneath the seat, you can see where that red wire is just about there. On that plug, basically all I did, because that's one of the seatbelt pretensioner kind of control modules or control cable, shall we say. All I did was basically just get in there and just kind of give it a wiggle. I didn't disconnect the battery or anything like that. Just kind of moved them around, moved the cables around. That's literally all I had to do. And on the other seat, I did exactly the same, but I did it just from behind. So kind of around from the back down there didn't disconnect the battery like I say or anything just literally I just moved the cables just tried to squeeze them plugs in a little bit more and now what we've got obviously is a nice clear dashboard once again so just a real quick one for today but hopefully that can be really useful to someone it might save a whole load of money paying out for investigative work that doesn't need to be done really quick really simple and now it's done so if you found it useful remember to hit like down below if you haven't done so already remember to hit subscribe coming up here now for more useful stuff like that as well Thanks very much for your time and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.